It is the third heat for the F300 Sprint class. Ben Harrison will be starting in pole position in the number 99 car after he won the second heat. Evan Holzhausen in second and Halema Ngadi will be starting in P3. Edwan Nadir in P4. And the flag is down and our cart is away. Evan Holzhausen with a fantastic start. He is on the outside. Ben Harrison on the inside. Evan diving to the apex and he will take the lead there. Followed by Ben Harrison. We will pick them up as they exit the tunnel. Let's see who's in the lead. It is Evan Holzhausen followed by Ben Harrison. Edwan Odia. He is up into third place. Again, we find ourselves with two distinct battle packs. Four cards out in front, four cards from P5 to P8 as they come around the double right-hander. Now coming up over the bridge into the right-left. Then a short little straight to the double left-hander and then they will come onto the start-finish line to complete the first lap of racing. You can see your leaderboard. It is Ivan Holzhausen in the lead, followed by Ben Harrison, Edwan Odia, Haleman Gadi in fourth, Duran Souls in fifth, followed by Nathan Aldhaus, Jose Himatlala, Nicholas Barrett. Evan Holzhausen drifting a little bit wide as he coming as he came into the right hander there. Coming over the bridge now. To the start finish line to complete the second lap. Coming into the first turn. It is Ben Harrison diving up the inside. Can Evan Holzhausen come with a cutback? might get him back into the hairpin right-hander. Let's see as they exit the bridge. The situation out in front. It is Evan Holtzhausen back in the lead. Ben Harrison in second. Edwan Nordea still in that third place. Here we can see Ben Harrison. He wants past. He wants that lead back. over the start finish line it is Ben Harrison again with a move cut back this time from Evan Holzhausen he's going to be on the outside coming to the hairpin Edwin Odia also losing that third place coming under the bridge it is Ben Harrison Evan Holzhausen Palema Mgadi in third followed by Edwin Odia the double left-hander. Oh, car drifting wide there. I think it is Nathan Aldaus in the 112 cart. Here you can see the positions changing out in front. Now Halema Mgadi putting Ivan Holzhausen under pressure. Still the same out in front. Evan Holzhausen looked like he might have made a move coming into the pit right-hander. Let's see if there's another change out in front. Palema now into second. So there was a change of position. Evan Holzhausen has taken the lead. Followed by Halema. Ben Harrison has dropped down to third. Edwin Odia still right behind this top three. Coming over the start finish line, there you can see the change in position. Ben Harrison dropping to third. The 
Ransell still in fifth, followed by Nathan. Corsi in seventh and Nicholas in eighth. Marshall waving a blue flag. I don't really know why. Doesn't make sense. Here we go, very tight out in front. Less than half a second separating these three cards. And then there's a battle for P6, P7 and P8 as well. Nathan Ald Aldaus. Oh, there was contact. Coming out of the double right-hander. Definite contact there. And he's pulled to the side of the road in the 1-1-2 card. Nathan looks like he's getting out of the card. And the marshal is there as well. More battling out in front. Evan Holzhaus and Ben Harrison. Chalem are side by side as they go to the hairpin. And let's see what has transpired there. Evan still out in the lead. Ben Harrison has taken back P2. And he's got his sights on Evan now for that lead. Still very close. Our top three cards here. Yellow flag is out for Nathan. There we can see Nathan on the left. He is out of the cart and the marshal is there as well. Yevon Holzhausen followed by Ben Harrison coming to the double left. Edouard Nodier losing a little bit of ground to this top three. Coming across the start finish line into turn one. No moves made. Yevon Holzhausen still in the lead. Halema very close behind Ben Harrison tucking in trying to get that slipstream. Look how close it is as they come to the double left. Ben Harrison practically on the bumper of that number 16 cart. Coming across the start finish line. A new personal best lap for, for Halema and Yevon Holzhausen. Side by side there's a spin. Holzhausen and Halema making contact. He spun out and he is going to drop all the way to the back of the field behind this battle for P5 and P6 between Durancels and Nicholas Barrett. So there was a change in the lead. Our leaderboard hasn't updated yet. Ben Harrison is in the lead now, followed by Evan Holzhausen in second. Third place now is Edouard Odia. Halema Mgadi is dropped down all the way to 7th and then there's this battle for P5 and P6 between Durant Sills and Nicholas Parrott. We're going to follow this battle for P5 now. Corsi Matlala and Nicholas Parrott battling for P5 and P6 there. You can see how much ground Halema has lost. That last lap of his a 107, so he lost about 14 seconds. That's the gap to our leader. One and a half second gap that Ben Harrison has in front of Evan Holzhausen. Comfortable lead. Edwin Odea is about half a second behind Evan. Durant still five seconds behind the leader and then there's a five second gap to this battle we're seeing now between Nicholas Barrett and Horsi Matlala to the double left hand of cards getting a little bit sideways there. Let's look at the lap times. Nicholas 53.8, Horsi 53.8, Palema doing a 52.7, 1.1 seconds he's taking out of that gap as the two cards P5 and P6 are side by side. Halema has got his sights on them now. He will be looking to close this gap as these two carts are battling it out. The 24 and the 15 cart. And there you can see the 99. He's back on a charge. But look at their last laps. Halema and P7 doing a 
Ben Harrison in the lead doing a 52.4 and Ivan Holzhausen doing a 52.5. Still with his battle for P5 and P6. There you can see Khalema is hunting them down. Let's check those lap times. New personal best by Duran Souls. Nicholas Parrot 53.5, Corsi 53.4, Khalema a 52.4. Another second out of that gap. As you can see on the track map, gaps have developed out in front between the top four carts, but the real battle is here for P5 and P6. We are on lap 12. As Ben Harrison is approaching the start finish line, there will be eight laps remaining. Look how close it is for P5 and P6 coming over the bridge, the right left hander. And that gap there, that gap to Khalema is way down now. It was 2.1 seconds. And now it's down to one second. Side by side again, Nicholas Parrott. Of course, he's having a fantastic battle for P5. Kalema, he's brought that gap down now to one cart length and he is in it. He can fight his way back to fifth after that spin, but he has two opponents right in front of him. P5, P6, P7. This Kalema is looking racy through the right, left, to the double left and He will be looking to get a good exit. Coming on to the start finish line, he is getting a double toe now. Two carts in front of him with a slipstream. And that is Horsey. He's looking to make a move, but no move made there. Halema, he's got an opportunity here on the cutback. He may just make his move into the right hand a hairpin. Let's see what happens. Oh! There is a cart pulling off. That is Khalema. It's the 99 cart. Unfortunately, we didn't see what happened there at the airpin. And he is out of this race. Very unfortunately. He was making a good comeback after his initial spin. Back with Ben Harrison in the lead. He tucks in. Tucks in to try and build that gap. He's already two and a half seconds behind. And that cap, gap to Ivan is not really coming down. Both of them posting 52.7. Edouard Nordea with a 53 dead, losing 3 tenths of a second to Ivan. There you can see the interval between the carts. This battle between Nicholas Barrett and Corsi get the feeling this might go down to the wire. Probably the fifth time they are side by side as they go into the hairpin. Under the bridge, let's see how they exit. Here they come. And it's still Nicholas Barrett doing a fantastic job to defend. Looks like Horsey, top right of your screen. He might have made his move there. Oh, taking very long to come out of the pin. Well, out of the right hand. Uh, there was definitely something that happened there. Fortunately, we missed it. Both cards very slow in that gap now. Probably about three seconds. So something happened there. We'll see from the lap times. Definitely a slow lap from these two cards. Not sure if there was contact, probably. Coming now across the start finish line. Nicholas Barrett 59 9. Corsi doing a 101. So definitely slow lap from them. There was some incident down at the pit lane right hander. Ben Harrison in the left, in the yellow cart through the double left hander. Evan Holzhausen in second. 52 8 for Ben, 53 dead for Evan. Edouard doing a 53 2, Duran a 53 1. Then you can see the big gap to fifth and sixth. This will be Nicholas Parrott in 5th, Corsi Matlala in 6th. Those lap times are very similar.
17 laps completed, 3 laps remaining. Your leader is still Ben Harrison. Grand Sills getting sideways through the double left-hander shows you how hard these carters are pushing. This is the penultimate lap of the race. Ben Harrison still out in front. Given Holshausen, this gap staying constant. Edouard Nordia currently in third. Grand Sills still in fourth. Now, final lap of the race. It is Ben Harrison leading the way. He should keep it together. Evan Halshausen should get it. his second P2 of the day. Good one with Dean third. Ransels in fourth. Half a lap remaining for Ben Harrison. Here he comes. He will take victory in the third heat. It is Ben Harrison. And he will cross the start finish line. Check it flag is out. Ben Harrison winning the third heat. Evan Holtzhausen comes home in second. Edouard Odier in third. Durancels in fourth. Then will be Nicholas Parrot and Horsey in fifth and sixth. Two retirements in this race, Halema Mgadi and Nathan Oldhouse, 7th and 8th.